well worth it in my view. And this, I can actually pivot this to panelists ask who stock should we buy related to where things are heading in AI. I would say buy stock in yourself. And this is something that I did strategically years ago when I was first, this is predates Salesforce. And this is my own thought process here as an entrepreneur, someone looking ahead. And so I thought, do I invest in Apple or do I invest in myself? And I'm glad I invested in myself. And what that looked like was getting a better computer. And I was going out and getting technical writing clients. And I was focused on ranking number one on Google for a Nashville technical writer and started getting some inbound leads. And through that means learned a lot about search engines that helped me to then build websites so that when the Snuggie hit and I had the idea for Snuggie sightings and where would I go to post pictures of people wearing them out in the wild? Cause I knew that they would, and it didn't exist. And there were zero results on Google for that. I thought this can simply cannot be. And I spent a weekend building that and got it out. And then it did hit the top of Google trends hit across all media imaginable. It was insane. And those were all light bulb moments for me. I would not have learned any of that if I bought Apple stock. Now, yeah, it would be worth more now, but I've made probably a thousand times more investing myself. And I encourage you to do like, well, and find your own path in order to make your own unique mark. And there's no one else in the world like you either. And so don't worry about what someone else is doing or compare. And I joked about Ryan having more certifications than me, but we can't be looking sideways. We can't be looking at what someone else is doing, but really focusing on what you have control over. And that is your response to these times and this opportunity. And this is, I believe, the start of the fourth industrial revolution. And we're, it's at the ground floor. 